Welcome back to the channel, you kooks. Today on the Van Kooks channel, it is summer and the mountains are calling and we are going to show you our favorite car camping setup for all of you beginner kooks that don't know what to get, don't know what to put on your list to get out there and car camp and live your best life. So let's get into it. So one of the first things you're gonna need if you're gonna go camping is a campsite. America's full of free campsites. BLM land, National Forest land, just do your research. Find out where there's a free campsite. We never pay. So next thing you'll need is a tent. This is a really nice budget tent. It's from Amazon. This, will, this whole setup will fit in any rig. We've done it in our Subaru. We've borrowed a car and put it in there. Another thing that we have in the tent here it, to make it comfortable is the Climate Static V uh, blow up mats. So those blow up in about like 25 breaths and they're really lightweight. You can take them um, backpacking with you. So we have those for backpacking and for car camping. So they're very versatile, very lightweight. Then we also have some of our sleeping bags. Uh, they're 32 degree sleeping bags. So let's come on in here and check it out. Camping in a tent is nice. We do have Subaru plans. Sometimes we sleep in our Subaru. But when it's so nice out, we like to just have the headroom and we can get out. We have a door on each side so we can both get out in the night and not wake each other up really with going to the bathroom. That's the tent and we've had that for quite a long time. So it does, even though it's cheap, it has lasted. So plus on that, kook certified. And the next thing that you will need for your camping setup is a kitchen. And what we have in our kitchen setup is this basket that we usually kind of keep uh, with like spices and stuff like that and we just tuck that away and when we want to use it it has all the like foundational things that you need for your kitchen as well as this thing too has all the foundational things always packed we always have paper towels a knife a sponge some camp suds some extra propane various types of bowls because we like to make sauces and stuff and we also have some spices in there some tea some coffee just so it's ready to go so you can camp on a whim if you would like. And then also what we have is this Eureka stove. This one also, like the Deer family, has lasted the test of time. Um, we've gone through plenty of these cooktops and this is the one that has lasted the test of time. So this one is kook certified. The other ones we have broken somehow. Also, you'll need some water. So we do, when we're car camping, we kind of are stopping a lot. So we're able to fill up water. So we're not too, we bring our camel back and a couple extra 40 ounce water bottles. So that's enough water for till the next fill up station. And then we also cook on a cast iron. You can get like a lodge at Walmart or, or Target or anything like that. And they're very easy to clean. Um, and they're just, can work on a campfire as well, which, are, which is great. They're very versatile. What we have here is, I love this fridge. Like that's the coolest part about how long Kevin and I have been doing like nomad life or whatever is technology has final, is finally here. And we used to pay so much money for all of these things like this fridge. This one is a super budget fridge. It reminds me of the Dometic CF-18, but a little bit bigger, a little bit more space in here. Um, super efficient. And you can turn it into a freezer if you want. It has an extra USB port here if you wanted to charge off that. And then it also has um, Bluetooth that you can connect to as well. And this one is called the Abosi. And this, that also plugs into this Blue Eddy um, EB55. And this thing is great. It's, it's charging off the sun right now. And then it's also keeping our food cool. So it's kind of like free energy. With this uh, Blue Eddy, we have... We love these things. Like I said, we're so stoked with the technology that has come along and we just like to try it all out, especially the budget stuff. So this one is a great budget item. This one's great because it has a wireless dock, but it is a little bulky compared to some of the other ones. I love how the handle folds down, um, but it is very efficient. It's one of the fastest charging ones that there is. Uh, it takes about 200 watts of solar. Like the Jackery is laughable compared to how fast this charges. So look into the Blue Eddy if you're looking for something that is not as expensive as Goal Zero and not as crappy as Jackery. Another unit that I like is this Omni Charge. This thing is great and like I said, I wish I had this when I was traveling overseas, but it has um, a charger for your computer or any AC charging there. It has USB fast charging 3.0s and then it has USB-C in and out. You can charge and put your phone on top, top to its wireless charging. Um, I use this when we're in the car or when, when I'm not close to um, 
the other charging station. So this is great backup. It fits in my backpack for my school and stuff that I'm doing. So we always have to have power and connection and, you know, service for school. And this thing is great if you're just doing a few nights and you just need to charge your phone and maybe charge your laptop once. This will get you through a few nights and it's small, compact, and doesn't take up much space. All right, so we went over your shelter, we went over your food, and now we're gonna go over the chill station. So you're gonna need uh, some folding chairs and stuff because um, it's just nice to be able to not sit on rocks and stuff. So it's nice that they fold up as well and that saves a lot of space. So you'll want them to fold and be compact. Same with this table. This is about the same size as these chairs folding up. You'll want a table to, to like cook and to do schoolwork if you have school do um, work if you have work. Uh, we also like having this, having like a blanket that we can kind of just not really care about. Just this is our camping blanket. It turns into a cape. So you can button and keep it as a cape and still use your hands. Maybe this is all too much and you just want to start slow and get into your, get your camping gear in order and then go out camping. Um, you can always start with a nomadic we like the Nomadic subscription. It gives you all kinds of cool goodies. So you subscribe and you get one of these a month. And in this one, there's a hammock, starter hammock for all you beginners. Um, some camping lights. There's a fork spoon, some hydration packs, some facial wipes, and oh, these come in, these come in handy. Patch holes, like if, for your um, blow up mattresses, sometimes you'll get a little prick in there from a rock or something. So it's nice to be able to have that. So if you want to get started, Nomadic is, is a great start. And with Nomadic, they're giving us a Van Kooks discount for all you kooks that are trying to get out there. So it's a pretty significant discount if you want to check it out and get you some nice camping material. I can't wait to use the lights tonight. All right, kooks, thank you so much for watching. I hope this video is helpful. And if there are some items that you liked that we were talking about, we do have some discounts down below for all you kooks out there. Um, thank you so much for watching. And the one thing that I forgot to mention was bring a shovel. You have to bring a shovel when you're out in nature and BLM and there isn't any porta potties. So make sure you dig deep and put that poo where it goes in the ground and have fun guys. Peace out. Bye.